down the running water. I've been able to see the stream for a while, it walks by this road. I'm about to do yon big hill. It doesn't look very big from here. It's sort of more like, well, I don't know, it's like more like that. Right? It just flattens out with it being a six mil lens on this thing. But yeah, that's all the problem with shit out of the way. But I think I've officially given up on um, on some people, you know, that, there's people out there that do, would rather I was shot in the head and fucked off. Um, is it because they want to do what I'm doing? That's the way you think, they don't. Uh, some of them don't want anybody to learn anything they know. Uh, they think it makes their careers safe. All they're doing is hold the whole bloody industry, you know what I mean? The whole idea is, it's like life, right? Caveman, first caveman was there, created fire. By the time he died, he taught his son to create fire. And he worked out, instead of, you know, waiting for lightning to strike, if he rubbed some sticks together when they were dry, hard and soft wood, it would make fire. And so it evolves. We're supposed to learn from the previous generation, or the previous lot of blokes, at what we do, right? All women, right? Because an increasing amount of women, so bloody should be. Uh, not going to fault the Sky, 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 sky Sports fucking trap. <laughs> yeah, but um, no, that's right though, they should be. But um, we're supposed to learn from each other. Now, how depressing would it be that if you look back online six years, put it this way, right? I've got great respect for Beer Raid, right? One of the guys who basically invented, he just about invented poly model and box model as we know it, right? As far as most people are concerned, you know, there's a few of the guys, but B is the one that people remember. Um, imagine if we'd never progressed beyond that because nobody shared their knowledge. How fucking depressing would that be? The reason we are able to do what we do is because people share knowledge. Knowledge isn't meant to be put in a little box with a big padlock on it so that you can't have an eight of mine because you might take my job. Well, you know what? If somebody takes your job, that means they're better than you. Or they've got better contacts. Either way, that means you need to pull your socks off, right? Simple as that. But, um, it's getting very windy. But yeah, hopefully you see my point on that. It's, um, I've officially given up on these people, though, you know what I mean? It's, it'll never be, whatever I do is never enough. It's like, you know, I do a DVD, then I, you know, I'm told it's DVDs for idiots. You know, this is the way, you know, it's like, fucking hell, have a look at Wave 2, you know what I mean? It's, um, that is very difficult to do, that brush style, because you need absolute control of your brush in mud box. Uh, mud box is not really on our service, it's possible, because I do it all the time. But, um, what I would say is, it's not, you know, I'm not trying to promo myself, but, you know, why is it okay for other people to release DVDs, but me not to? Why is it okay for other people to promo the shit out of their work, but the moment I do it, I'm Satan? Is it because some of these people are ZBrush fanboys? I don't think so. I'd like to think not, because I've, I'm friends with a lot of people who are um, ZBrush users, both right the way across the spectrum. You know, because let's face it, more people use ZBrush than use Woodbox, right? Um, and it's pretty unavoidable. They don't see me going and insulting the bastards, you know. It's like something that may surprise you. A while ago, I bought out of my own pocket a copy of 3D Code. Why? Am I going to suddenly change? No, but neither am I going to rule out tools that will work well in my pipeline and save me time, simply because people think we're in Robson Mudbox, right? That's not the way it works. I will do what needs to be done for production. I've said that a million times in these videos. Now, their retopology tools are pretty damn good, right? Um, and I love Top Wheel Gun, but it hasn't had an update for a long time. Uh, there are things that are missing from it. Uh, I hope Chris is working on a version because, you know, I still use it, right? If there's a few things that were added in. But um, as at the moment it appears he's not, or he's um, not doing a whole lot, if he is, you know, he's not making it public, then I've got no choice, right? I've, I've always said I will always use the most powerful and the best tool for me at the time. At the moment, for read topology, 3D Eco seems to do the job, right? But um, I very rarely buy software, funny enough. People normally give it to me, but you know what? It's pretty, pretty safe bet that the 3D Code guys aren't going to give me software, being known as the Mudbox guy, right? Um, you won't see a um, load of tutorials on 3D Code. Not because I'm hiding any knowledge, but it would simply be bad form, you know what I mean? Um, it's, to be honest, it's the only bloody software I haven't. On the sculpting front, well, I suppose 
I think I put one video out hidden somewhere on uh, Sculptors because uh, I quite like that but uh, it needed to mature and I don't think it ever will now not the way it should uh, <coughs> feel free to disagree but uh, yeah it's you know it'll be in some ways yeah it'd be nice to do a video just a freebie you know just to see how I've done the ball but why would I be doing it would it simply start and say that a wear is an expert in all three sculptures? No, fuck off, that's ridiculous, right? If I was doing something that nobody else had thought of or knew how to do, then I'd think about it. Um, but if I'm just doing the same as everybody else has done, it's no point. Besides, it's pretty well covered as it is. You don't need me sticking my fucking oar in. You know, but uh, it's like in the last week. Uh, a job I've been working on, the client requested um, that I did a certain part of the workflow in ZBrush. Did I tell them to fuck off? Of course I didn't. I said, okay, fair enough, click, click, off we go. Sculpting, sculpting, right? And what all the, you know, the people who make the application would like to pretend they're all different. When you get down to your basic sculpting, they're all just about the scheme, you know what I mean? Um, it's down to features and what you like, what you don't like, and what feel you like. That's what it's down to. Neither side pays me money. Oh, well, I shouldn't say neither side because you've got more than one player now, you've got more than two. None of these people pay me any money. They say this software is nice, this software is not, right? And, uh, oh, fucking hell. You're looking nice from up here. Thank you for the back. But, um, so of my opinion, opinion of friendship, Tough. I'm a loud one. You know, same as you are. Opinions are like arseholes. We all have one. And their equity is valid. But, uh, I wasn't too much to mention about the 3D core thing. Didn't mention it on Twitter or anything. But, um, you know, it's, I'm not going to get into a 3D core bash. I'm not going to do anything. I've made my feelings known on program. As I said before, anybody ever gets their hands on it, and sort of buys a control interest or buys it up from Andrew Shapagan and spends 12 months getting rid of the bugs everybody's got fucking problems then because it's got a lot of features um, but I'm not getting into all that you know, case in point of another thing we've covered a video or two back um, because when I bought it, I bought it out of sequence I thought I had an NFR that Chris of 3D Pals has had he said, well, use this one and upgrade this, all right? Because he's not give it away, you know, the people and stuff. And uh, let's face it, he's going to do, do a silly little sculpting or review. It would be me that would get the fucking job, you know what I mean? But um, <clears throat> I realised I couldn't actually upgrade that. But I already paid for the pro licence, upgrade. So I'll go back and buy the student one, right? Or the educational job you then upgrade it, right? Which, funny enough, worked out cheaper for some bizarre reason. They want to sort that. But anyway, so... I was a bit in shoot dude, so I actually went to Pat Nolan, right? Pat, Pat's known in the 3D world very well. And I'm not Pat, I said, I'm made, because I'm you, you know, what the fuck do I do, right? Who do I contact? So he gave me an email. It was sorted instead of 12 hours. It probably would have been sorted sooner, but it was night time, right? But, uh, so, we don't go around trying to kill each other. You know, we have, we might use different software and do different things. Maybe even have different opinions. But we're all people, and we all are doing a similar job. If you can't show people, you know, in your own field a certain amount of respect, then who the hell can you? Valid question. Now to put a tin out on this sort of week, as if I was not busy enough. Um, Kane's been ill with flu and thrown up. That's my son, he's five and a half. Emily has been ill with the flu. She's, well, it's actually she's 23 months at the end of this month, middle of this month. Um, and the wife came down with it, and I was fucking nursemaid again. Luckily, the wife shrugged it off. Emily's through this side, Kane's not yet. Although, Pat's having a bad school, you can't get off for too long. It's a school whinge, you know, if you actually have day to be ill. But yeah, it's. Um, you know, that's not ideal because that means I've got less hours to do my stuff in, but again, being a dad comes first, you know, but we'll see. 
Geburtstag. Oh ja, Bruder. Gas. Oh, fuck. But uh, yeah, so it's the 10 minutes now after wind up. Uh, always been an informative one for you. And again, obviously, I'll look over Filter Forge. There's a few things coming up over the next few weeks. The first few, it's going to be a mix of theory and practical. It's once you get the practical stuff, it's about number four, right? Week four. Uh, I think it's another week after next, or next week. Uh, keep your eye on it, you know, and uh, there's some, some interesting stuff towards the end, but we'll see. But again, some people think they know it all. Yes. Which I'd quit for every time, but it proved wrong. But anyway. See you all next time. I'll probably get shot for that comment. They hate it when I say that, you know, because I don't preempt when they're going to do it. <laughs> See ya.